How should we be taking care of our teeth? Hi, I'm Dr. David Perlmutter and I'm a, I'm a neurologist, so why would I be posing that question? Well, it's actually very relevant because our state of oral health is really uh, very influential in terms of brain health, in terms of heart health, in terms of risk for diabetes and even hypertension. So these things obviously, for good reason, are important for me, again, as a neurologist, but really uh, being one concerned with overall health as well. So what should we be doing? And I think one of the biggest issues is, you're gonna think this might be a little unusual, avoid antibacterial mouthwashes. We now see some really good research demonstrating that certain antibacterial mouthwashes or those mouthwashes that you see uh, advertised because they kill 99.9% .9 of horrible germs are actually associated, their use, uh, with increased risk of becoming diabetic and or becoming hypertensive. Why would that be? Because certain bacteria in the mouth that live on the back top of the tongue are involved in converting nitrate from our nitrate-rich foods, like certain vegetables, into nitrite. The body uses nitrite to make nitric oxide. Nitric oxide is important for allowing insulin to work and even in allowing our blood vessels to relax so our blood pressure stays under control. When we damage those bacteria, we are at risk. So I uh, use a water flosser. Uh, I have a one for travel that's rechargeable, but we have a full-on plug-in one at home. I also use an electric toothbrush, uh, and I um, am not, not using a toothpaste that contains sodium lauryl sulfate, um, and I don't really feel the need to use a fluoride-containing toothpaste at this point. I love hearing that Dr. David Perlmutter talks about this because this is what biological dentists have been shouting for years. Your mouth isn't just about your teeth, it's a functional ecosystem that impacts your whole gut, your bloodstream, your brain and your metabolism. It's the entrance to the whole body. It's basically your gut. And yes, antibacterial mouthwash is a huge problem. You're not just killing bad breath, you're destroying the exact species your body needs to produce nitric oxide. And that's what helps regulate blood pressure, blood sugar and cellular repair. So when you wipe that out daily, you're actually working against your own biology. You're not trying to sterilize the mouth, stop killing the good bacteria. We're working with your biology and support your gut and immune system, which actually starts in the mouth.